Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your boy Tristan Barracks here, the digital storyteller, and I'm super excited to be with you for another episode of Cinecut, where we will be unboxing. Well, I don't want to tell you right now, it's a surprise. So you're just going to have to watch the intro and then see what I'm going to unbox after that. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's go. Woo! One of the Kickstarter projects that I funded was, drumroll please, da -da 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 -da, the Monocaster. Now the best way to kind of explain what the Monocaster is, is well, it's pretty much a direct ripoff of the Roadcaster Pro. Now, now again, don't get me wrong, I mean, there are probably some differences, but for the most part, this particular product is exactly the same. It's just a baby version of it. And I was intrigued by this particular product because I wanted to look at other options uh, that I could use that were a little bit less expensive than the Rodecaster Pro. And to be honest with you, the Rodecaster Pro, it's a little bit heavier and it's about 800 to $1,000 depending on when you get it on sale or not on sale. And I really don't wanna travel with that sort of uh, technology with me. So I decided to go in on backing this monocaster um, product or project, and it took forever to come. Let me tell you something. Child, please. This, this, this thing took way more months, like probably four to five to six months longer than it was supposed to take. But we're gonna unbox it now. We're gonna check it out. And I wanna know what your comments are too. I'm, I, I haven't opened it up. I actually saved it specifically for this channel for you guys because I want you guys to experience it just like I'm experiencing it now. By the way, how many people like this this sign right here? I know I know it's, it's flickering. Yes, I know. I have a high shutter, whatever. It don't matter. It still looks dope, right? Tell the truth, though. Tell the truth. So, all right. Let me flip this, take this box away. And here we go. Here we go. Here we go. So, we got the Monocaster right here. Professional audio innovation. I don't know about the innovation part. The professional audio part, okay, I get. But uh, I don't know about the innovation. Uh, can anybody say Roadcaster Pro? Anyways, um, this is the the AM100. Now, the AM100 is just the actual interface itself. It's not, uh, it doesn't come with a mic. It doesn't come with anything else extra. So if we look at it back here, we have a few different inputs. So we can input speakers. We can input um, a couple of phones, actually a lot of phones. Um, we have uh, two XLR inputs. I digress. Let's open this up. Oh, come on. I want to open you up. I want to open you up. Big ups to the packaging. Buddy. Big ups to the pack packaging. You don't know the thing, though. You don't know the thing. The thing's nice, yo. Sorry, I'm, I'm feeling kind of hype. It's like 1 o'clock in the morning right now, 1.30. So, wow, what is this? You open up this and you see the monocaster, uh, these cardboard things. No, what these are, are these are actually like placeholders for your sound effects. So when you have, um, when you start putting your sound effects, uh, saving them into the monocaster, um, you can remember it by the color uh, that you fill it out in and then also by the square that you actually saved it to. So you can actually write that in. Actually in the, the Roadcaster Pro box, uh, it comes with the same sort of thing. Uh, it's actually really, really similar, guys. Like, it's it's super similar. So, anyways, you have front and back, and you can kind of label that. So, that's kind of cool. I'll put that over here. Um, what's this here? Monocaster Podcast Console. So, we have some instructions. Um, I guess if you don't know how to use one of these, <laughs> these are the, the instructions right here. And, yeah, I'll throw this away. This is kind of, kind of boring. Let me jump on to the good stuff. Oh, look. Wow. Um, podcast console. So it's basically showing us um, showing us how we can connect it to our laptops and so on and so forth. This is how the actual console looks. And I don't even know if it's this size. I think it might be even smaller than this. Oh, this is nice. But we'll see. We'll figure it out uh, together. So this is a letter from um, 
uh, mono because uh, we are a backer. So it says letter to uh, backers of Monocaster. Now, I'm not going to read all this because I just don't want to read all this. But uh, this is really, really nice. I think I might not hang this up. Um, but I'll keep it for safekeeping because this is the first time I've, I've, well, second time I've backed something. Um, and they really, they really went all the way with that to have that little letter to the backer. So that's kind of cool. All right. So we got a little bit of styrofoam here. Ooh, looky, looky. Okay. Okay. I like it. I really, really do like this. You know, one of the things that, that I find really, really cool about this is that it's so much smaller. Like, look at this. This is the whole interface here. Wow. Like, my head's almost like bigger than this. My head is yeah, it's still smaller, I think. Anyways, um, so, so this is really nice. It's very tiny and cute. It's like a baby. It's like a baby roadcaster. I like this. Road, you guys should really think about getting, like, something small like this, doing a small design. This is really dope. I like I like the size of it. That's one thing I like. So let's see what's inside these boxes here. Okay, so this is this giant box is for the is for the USB C cable. This giant box. Are you are you kidding me right now? Oh, and la what lavalier mic? I didn't. This is a surprise. Oh my goodness! Uh, thank you so much, Monocaster. Oh my goodness. So this is the this is the the interface or the the cable for um you know uh connecting it to your computer. So that's pretty straightforward. And then also, I guess because they took so long, this was my this was my little my little um what is it? My little thank you gift for waiting so long for for the monocaster. We got a new a new microphone or a new lapel. This is one of the largest capsules I've ever seen um, for a lapel in a long time. But hey, it was for free. I ain't complaining. Y'all can complain. I ain't complaining. I ain't complaining. What so have And what's inside here? What's inside here? What's inside here? Audio cable. Okay, so as you can see, nice packaging there again. Audio cables. So let's let's pull these out here. Oh, there's a lot of audio cables here. So they're pretty much all AUX cables. Like there's like so these ones that are the podcasting. These ones right here that are the podcasting um, cables actually have three areas. So one area for the mic. Uh, and then the other areas for the left and right speakers. And then these ones just have one or two stripes. So these are just for speakers. Uh, so that's, that's the major difference there. But they're pretty much, I mean, they're pretty much cables you can get anywhere. Um, they're not cables that, you know, you have to go really far to find and replace. I like the, the matte finish to it. It has a little satin matte finish to it that's pretty nice yeah and uh, i think that's it i don't know let me check let me check here let me see if there's anything else nope that that seems like all she wrote here i am really really excited about trying this out but i'm just wondering where is my power cable hmm that's interesting where is the power cable? Am I am I am I crazy? What's what's going on here? I have no idea. Well, let me plug this in and try this out and do like a really initial test and we'll we'll see where it goes from there. All right, give me a second. All right, so I have the monocaster. I have my headphones in here um plugged in. I have the USB type C cable plugged into ND Pro uh, battery, um, V mount battery, just so I can I can power this thing up because it didn't come with a, a power adapter, which is kind of weird. But nevertheless, apparently though, I was doing some checking. Uh, this this particular interface or um, product actually has a built-in battery, which is dope. 
that's dope. And that's something to think about because when you're talking about portability and being able to have that flexibility of going anywhere and not worrying about having to have something hardwired in, that's really, really an attractive feature, uh, you know, as opposed to the Roadcaster Pro, which has to be plugged in. I mean, you can get power bricks, but it's a lot larger of a device compared to this device. So I have also plugged in and, and uh, hooked up my second pod, uh, pod mic, Rode pod mic, because I really like them. Um, so I'm going to end. I want the test, just the initial test to, to be something somewhat of a similar um, situation. So let me turn this on and we'll see what it sounds like. Hey, 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 hey. So this is what this mic sounds like. Uh, I am going to actually turn this up a bit. Turn this up. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hey, 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 hey. And now you see that we actually have levels as well on here. Um, so what's going on? How are you doing today? Testing, testing, one, two, three. Um, and if I don't talk at all, you'll notice that I am actually, um, I'm actually quiet. There is no hissing or anything of like that coming from the, the monocaster. No hissing, no nothing at all. So with the with the monocaster, uh, we can also add things, add effects. So I can go in and hit on male effect. And this is the male effect. I don't know how this sounds like a male effect. It's kind of weird. Then there's the female effect uh, that allows me to record the female, uh, my voice like a female, I guess. Um, then there's music only. Uh, which means basically if you're playing a song, you can kind of like reduce the audio of the vocals and it's just the music only. Check out the different modes here. Hello, hello, hello. Next mode here. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hall mode, valley mode. Valley mode is this. And then we also have the room mode. All right, so we have all of those. Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your boy Tristan Barracks here, the digital storyteller, and I'm super excited to be with you once again for another episode of Seneca, where we will be talking about, I don't know. I'm gonna try that one more time, uh, but with the Roadcaster Pro so you can see the difference. Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your boy Tristan Barracks here, the digital storyteller. I'm super excited to be with you once again for another episode of Seneca. Well, that ends another episode of Cinecut with your host, me, Tristan Barracks. I hope you learned something and you had fun too. If you are not a subscriber of the channel, please consider subscribing to the channel. And if you have questions or comments, please leave them below. Hit me up on all my social media platforms, at Tristan Barracks. And until the next time, stay creative. Peace.